Hi everyone, it's Alan here once again. Yeah, I've been, uh, well, I've been, I've been looking around some of the YouTube channels and yeah, pretty good, pretty good. Um, I stumbled on a new YouTube channel. Well, it's been around for quite some time, which I've just discovered. It's called Secret Blackburn. Um, I don't really know much about this channel, but uh, yeah, I've I've caught it a few times, and uh, some of the videos he puts up are really good. Really, really good. And uh, it goes to all these different places of Blackburn and uh, tells, tells, you, tells you about hidden gems about Blackburn. To be truthful, <laughs> to be truthful, it's stuff that, you know, I knew about, but the way the guard puts a puts it across is really really great and I don't, I don't really I don't I couldn't really find out how many subscribers he has but uh, I've been looking at some of the other Blackpool Blackburn channels and uh, a lot of them seem to be you know one video wonders sort of thing you know uh, a guy walking around Blackburn Town Centre when it was, uh, you know, before the changes, like, you know. Uh, old Northgate and uh, old, uh, what was it? Mill Hill and, yeah. Bank Top was uh, another one, and I think another one was Witten Country Park. Yeah, very nice. But as I said, quite a lot of the Blackburn channels are quite, uh, shall we put it, stale, and they haven't had major updates for quite some time, and. Uh, a lot of them seem to be, you know, I think one of them was over ten, ten year old since it was last up, la since it last had an update on, on it or a new content put on it. And there are some, some YouTube channels of Blackburn, of which, <laughs> in a lot of cases. The creators have basically turned around, done, done a film, dumped it on there, and just forgotten, forgotten, uh, in some cases that it's there. And uh, it's quite a shame, pe people, you know, they start a channel and don't put anything else on it, um, because the di video didn't do do so well and. X, Y, Z. So if, if you come across the uh, secret Blackburn vlog, uh, give him a give him a like and a give him a like and so and a subscribe, because he does uh, go to some places. Um, Leeds, lots of it's based on the uh, Leeds Liverpool Canal. They know how long that thing is. Yeah. Um, didn't do much today. Because due to the weather. It started off pretty nice. And uh, after that. It just went south really quick. And I mean really quick. And I don't know what happened, you know. 
And then later on into the afternoon, it started turn, turning around again. Uh, it started to, as I said, it started in the day, in the morning, pretty, pretty good. Uh, we thought they got the forecast wrong. But so uh, late, later on in the day it came, uh, then it started to uh, grow a bit miserable. Yeah. So I'm going to have a look for some more Blackburn YouTube channels and uh, see if they've put anything uh, recent up. Um, or, and done some follow-up uh, blogs. Because... It's like what I said. People make a channel. Oh, I'll we'll have a go at this YouTube malarkey. And uh, they do one, two, three, four. I think one had had about five uh, videos on it. Once I've once they've done uh, done that, they just I think they just turn around and oh, I can't be bothered anymore, and uh, just left it at that yeah so if you find this channel the secret secret blackburn secret black blackburn yeah give them a like and subscribe and see if it's your cup of tea sort of thing and uh yeah hopefully tomorrow i'll be going out and uh well Go around the town centre a little bit. Maybe, maybe a bus ride tomorrow. See what happens. See what the weather does. And uh, we'll take it from there. Yeah. So, I wonder if we're going to have... For the past three, three, four days, we haven't had many of the boy races out at out on Wally New Road New Look put your teeth back in Alan on Wally New Road and Wally Old Road of late. Uh it's either the police have got to him or they just can't be bothered coming out. But uh wait and see. Wait and see. Um yeah, so I'm just waiting now to see, I think it's Tuesday or Wednesday, the new planning applications go in, so I'm going to see what's got, what's going to be happening about those, um, yeah. Uh, a video when I can't remember which company it was, but uh, a company put out a video uh, this month about uh, investing in property in certain certain areas, and I must admit, no Lancashire towns were mentioned. No Lancashire towns were mentioned. They were all mainly Greater Manchester. And uh, I thought, well, that's a bit odd, you know what I mean? But uh, I had another look. And th I think the reason why they didn't get a mention is because the inv because the investment wasn't there, and the companies weren't there. Yeah, bit sad, really. Um, I'm just waiting to find out about this next project uh, in Preston. Who's going to be doing it? Um, I know. Alliance Investments, Property Investments, 
Um, or carrying on with the exchange in Preston. But I must admit, I'm very disappointed with the progress that they're making on that project. Um, it's pretty, I don't know, it's pretty slow. You know, it's pretty slow. And I don't know how far up they're going. 15, 16 floors, something like that. But uh, I had a look at their other pr projects and the projects there, are, the other projects are quite substantial, quite tall. Um, but I, I've no idea how high they're going to go with it, with the exchange in Preston. But uh, I'll find out sooner or later when it's when it's complete. But uh, what I've been hearing is it's uh, going to be for students' accommodation. Um, yeah, and it's all going to be rentals. Um, believe it or not. And uh, it's going to be in a good spot. But uh, it's in a bit of an awkward place, really. Because across the road you've got... Um, I think it's people and places. Yeah, people and places, affordable housing across the road um, on there so it's going to be a contrast of uh, mixed development there um, the lamb I've heard is going to be used as mixed use but to be honest that pub looks like an absolute mess it needs it needs it needs uh redoing and i mean redoing it needs a good clean up and all that and the derby derby apartments they've restarted the um renovation work to it but to tell you the truth the building looks an absolute you know, it looks an absolute dump. And uh, no matter no matter what you do with that, um, well, Tarvishire Apartments, well, no matter what you do with that, that building would look ugly. To be truthful, that building needs ripping down. Absolutely ripping down. And... A complete two new, a complete new um, project put there, because to be truthful, that building's had it. It really has. Um, yeah, not good. Right, I'm going to disappear now because I haven't got much to say on there for for another whatever. And I just hope everybody's having a great evening or a great day or whatever, whatever time it is when you see this. So I'm going to bugger off now. And if anything happens, I'll let you know. So bye from me for now. Three, two, one, click.